If graffiti is commonly identified as text, usually a name, what happens when that text is replaced with an image or a logo? Is it still graffiti or does it become something else? In this short video, I'm going to discuss how the British art collective The Toasters used stencils, posters and stickers to transform a banal everyday object into a street art icon. This journey of repetition and iconography dates back thousands of years and there's no way I'm going to be able to cover it all in 60 seconds. But at the turn of the last millennium, it was artists like The Toasters, Shepard Fairey, Invader, D-Face who were instrumental in this cultural shift that merged graphic into the sensibilities of graffiti. Even though everybody could recognize what this image was, nobody really understood what it meant. But through repetition, it was able to become absorbed into the landscape of British culture while simultaneously blurring the lines between graffiti and street art. Let me know in the comments who you'd like to hear me discuss next.